Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Heating Up. I am Joe, and it is uh, Monday, April 19th. I uh, hope everyone had a great weekend. Uh, kind of took a break from the videos, from the YouTube. Uh, you know, just kind of, I just had to step back for a bit and take a break and, uh, you know, self care. Self care is good. Um, it was a great weekend. Uh, I did work, but, um, you know, I spent a lot of time with family and um, just, uh, just sometimes need to take a step back and um, um, Johnny said on a comment uh, it's uh, not a sprint it's a marathon and he's absolutely right I can't keep pounding out four videos a day um, one I'm gonna burn myself out two I'm gonna run out of content uh, for you guys so uh, <coughs> excuse me so I have another sauce review it's my third in the uh, box that I won from Heat 101 Heat 101, uh, Pucker Butt Pepper Company. This is their Reaper Squeezins. Triple X, you got the scythe, you got the Grim Reaper on here. Cool looking bottle. Um, so yeah, this is from Puck, 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 Pucker Butt Pepper Company. Grower, harvester, and producer of great tasting and all natural pepper products. Including hot sauces, jellies, mustards, salsas, seasonings, seeds, and plants. Home of the world's hottest pepper, Smokin' Ed's Carolina Reaper. Um, and it's distributed by Pucker Butt Pepper Company. They are in Fort Mill, South Carolina. Uh, so, from the bottle, I'm going to assume this is a screamer. Um, from the ingredients, I can assure you it's probably going to be pretty hot. This is probably the one sauce that I've had with the least amount of ingredients in it. Um, Check this out, guys. Really small, but it has. Are you ready? Reaper peppers, distilled vinegar, Reaper pepper powder. That's it. Again, Reaper peppers, distilled vinegar, and Reaper pepper powder. So, uh, yeah, she's going to be a warm one, I think. Silas. Shakey shake. Uh, if you guys are missing Silas, uh, like I said before, summer's coming. He's uh, itching to fish, so he'll be here when he's here. That's all I can tell you guys. Uh, but I will give him all your love, and uh, you know I'm just letting him do his own thing. Uh, I'm not gonna force him to to do anything that he doesn't want to do so consistency medium I'd say a medium sauce you can see all the peppers and seeds and goodness going on here uh, I will not be tainting chase the heat hot sauce spoon link in the description below for this as well as for this Mother of Pearl Spoon doesn't alter the flavor of any sauces. Um, it's a game changer. It's a must have if you're in a hot sauce or uh, pretty much anything you don't want to change or alter the flavor of. Uh, ice cream. I, I mean, anything really, I guess. Uh, yogurt. Uh, but, but hot sauce for sure. So, uh, open this up. I know you're not going to believe me, it smells like Reapers, go figure, right? Yeah, I'm just getting peppers and some vinegar, which is weird because that's all that's in it. Uh, so, Alright, so without further ado guys, here's the pour, Chunkies. All right, so this is Reaper Squeezins from Pucker Butt Pepper Company. This is Joe from Heating Up. Cheers. Mm. 
Definitely taste the reaper. Hits you right in the back of the throat immediately. Pure, all natural heat. And that's exactly what you're getting right here. Excuse me, guys. It's safe to say that nobody in my house is going to eat this. You get that pepper flavor and right at the end, the vinegar holds everything together. She's warm. If you're not into hot sauce, you're not going to like this at all. This is going to be a one and done for you. Sides of my mouth and my throat are burning right now. I'd say I'm at maybe a, a, a good two right now. Good solid two. Uh, I think I'm going to use this. on some chicken. Yep, this is going to be great on chicken. I'm going to throw some chicken on the grill and right at the end I'm just going to douse it and caramelize all this goodness onto the chicken. Yeah, so this was my Reaper Squeezins review. Uh, heat for a non-chili head, it's going to be warm. It's going to be an 8 or a 9 maybe even a 10. It's going to be enough to get your attention where you're going to stop using it quickly. Um, but there will be a link in the description for this as well as for this. Uh, I was going to do another video this morning, like a kind of a challenge video. Uh, I don't think I'm going to have time because I'm working today. I have to go to the post office and run some errands. Uh, so I think I'm going to wait and do that tomorrow morning for you guys. Uh, I'll give you a hint. It involves tincture and red solo cup. One person knows about it besides my family, and that's Robert B. I talked to him about it the other day. Um, so yeah, I think I'm going to do that tomorrow. Uh, I'm going to try, I might try to get another video in tonight at work if it's slow, on a break. If not, it is what it is. Like I said, I'm going to try to pump the brakes a little bit and, uh, you know, focus on family and what's important. Um, obviously you guys are family and I love you all. Uh, but, got to focus on family here too and, uh, Yeah. Uh, Rhett Grizzly Heat, love you brother, hopefully if uh, you do your tube today, I can watch that. Uh, Steve Heat My Shorts Gillespie, love everything you do brother. Robert B, you are a beast dude, saw that video, um, Tube of Terror, you crushed it. Didn't think you were going to get it through, uh, through halfway through, but uh, you persevered man, props to you. Uh, Uncle Remus, uh, James J. Blanco's Bits. I just subscribed to his channel. I can't believe I haven't subscribed. If you uh, watching this, go check his page out. Uh, Heating with Jay. Big Al. Tommy Scoville. The clean shaven Tommy Scoville. Hats off to you, my sir. Props to you for, you know keeping your end of the bargain. I knew you would. I knew Tommy or Johnny would. You guys are great. Love you. Much love from my family to yours. Uh, you're the reason we're doing this. You're the reason I'm doing it, but I can tell you you're the reason a lot of people are doing it. So thank you all so much. Thank you for the support of the channel. Uh, growing quickly. Not quickly, but 
uh, slowly. Um, but for me, it's not about subscribers. It's just about having fun and, you know, burning with you guys. I really enjoy it, and it gives me uh, an outlet. And uh, couldn't thank you enough. If you like what you saw here, thumbs up, please. Uh, click the bell for notifications. Subscribe. Tell your friends. Share. Share my videos. Um, and have a great day. Be nice to people. Reach out to someone. Tell someone you love them. You know, be kind. Like Rhett says, be kind to people. It costs zero dollars. Um, and it comes around full circle. So the world we're living in now, um, a little kindness goes a long way. And I'm uh, trying to remember that. I'm trying to think of glass half full. Just trying to be positive and uh, focus on what's good in my life. Joya, I love you with all my heart. I, you know, wouldn't be here doing this without your support and your love. So thank you so much. You're my rock, my better half, my best friend. Um, so I love you. I love everyone. I'm going to cut this video short so I can uh, get my day going, do some errands, and uh, eat some breakfast. So uh, without further ado, this is Joe from Heating Up. I'll catch you all beautiful people on the next one. I love you.